In this social traffic networking video, we're going to look at Twitter, which is growing and growing by popularity. It's considered by many to be like the next step on from blogging um, in respect of its very short snapshots of what you are doing right now. Um, many people say that it's a complete suck of your time. It just absorbs all of your time and effort. Um, but ultimately, again, if you can get followers from Twitter, um, and you can get people following what you're doing and taking part and joining in and absorb and get those people involved in what you're doing, uh, then you can use it to promote sites, services, videos, and combine it with other services and other ways of driving traffic. It could be uh, quite beneficial to you. It's just another way of getting your name out there for the search engines to find you, and it's also a way for people to join your list and follow you along as, as a Twitterer or whatever, or Twitty, whatever they're called, I'm not sure. Just to give an example here, I'm going to go to uh, an internet marketer you may have heard of. His name's Joel Com, uh, known mainly for AdSense and also for The Next Internet Millionaire, which was a virtual reality show he did recently on the web. And here he's got his own Twitter site. And as you can see, just making posts casually, different days on an ongoing basis, telling people what he's doing. And each time, how to make money using on domain, your domain names, probably an affiliate link check out a new promotional video, goes to his site, let's click it. Takes him away from the page, takes him to the site, it's now at his website. So as you can see, this is a way of getting people to follow what you're doing, but if you make notes that perhaps engage them enough and then give them a de decent link, they'll follow it, you can make sales, build your list, etc, etc. And as you can see here, with pictures of all these different people already, and you can view them all here if you wish. So that's the usefulness of Twitter. Let's look at how we join. We hit join. And in fact, just to make it easy for you, I'm going to take you back to the main page. Let's go to twitter.com rather than showing it from someone else's profile. And all we do here, once the page is loaded, excuse my connection today, is we get started and join. As you can see here, it says Twitter is a service for friends, family, co-workers to communicate, stay connected through the exchange. Used in the right way, of course. As we said, it's a traffic generation. Great thing is you can even Twitter by SMS or instant message. You can actually send posts to your Twitter. You don't have to be logged into your account to make comments. You can even send in a text. So let's hit get started now. And then the page will come up for us to start our setup. Okay, as always, we're going to add ourselves here. So we want to um, put our details. We can see here it's available. We put in a password, and we put in our email address, and then we hit in the information here, which that looks like is what it is, and then we hit, if you want the inside scoop, let's say yes, and we create our account, and we go on to the next page. And again, they're asking us for our Gmail, or Hotmail, or Yahoo and we enter it here and it will then go through our address book to see if our friends are on Twitter and if so it'll add their details um, to the site or you can invite someone directly or you can just skip this step it's entirely up to you I'm going to skip this for now but you could go through that part as well okay so now that we've done that what are we doing I am signing up to Twitter today for the first time. As you can see, you've only got a limited amount of words. You can't, it's not like a blog where you can type for hours. You can only put in a certain amount of types of letting people know what you're doing. So we hit, and it says here, tell us what you're doing now. Find some friends, turn on your mobile phone to update your friends on the go. You grab an RSS feed as well, place it on your blog if you want to. Great way of doing it. Hit update. Okay. So we can find some friends and see what they're doing. You can see what it's doing here. You can set up your phone or instant message as well, so you can add it in. So you put in your mobile phone number here. Um, so if you're in a country code like I am, you put in your uh, number here, and you put in your instant messenger and hit save as well. 
so I'm just going to quickly do that now. Just to show you here, it says Twitter really shines when you're away from your computer. By hooking up your mobile phone, you can receive the updates from those that you're following, or just some people. Uh, when you're waiting in boring lines, and you can send updates like uh, there's a monkey walking down the street. You know, at the end of the day, it's going to get people reading it. So it's all done through uh, SMS, so you can actually talk um, to your Twitter site. And Twitter doesn't charge anything for this, of course, but the uh, need to check what your plan will be with your wireless network. And also note that you can uh, shut text messages from Twitter off at any time by replying with off and back on by sending on and you can even specify that it turns automatically off at night etc so you can actually have messages of following people to your SMS now again if you were creating a Twitter site that became an addictive site if you were doing something out of the ordinary that were getting people to follow you imagine the power here of having people getting your updates to their mobile phone they're that hooked on what you're doing if you're clever enough with your marketing spin they want to follow you by mobile phone or whatever. So that's the option here. We can just enter the information and hit save. In this one, after doing the phone, you can go to notices and set up the notice features, which is like here, auto nudge. So nudge me if I haven't updated in 24 hours. This will send a text to your phone or a message to your IM account. Um, show me replies to the people I'm following. Uh, new follower emails. Email me when someone starts following me. Email when I receive a new direct message and I want the Inside Scoop newsletter. Also picture. Go to picture so we can upload our picture to the site. And add it here as part of our profile. So again, when people start following you, they can see that you are a, um, you're real. So you just upload the picture. And then the final page here is the design page where you can use the default style. You could create your own style. You can use a background image, you can upload your own image, you can do different colors, and you can save. So we'll just leave that as default for now. But that's how you set it up. And that's it. Then just basically keep posting your Twitters and letting people know what you're doing and uh, make it as a consistent practice that you're doing with everything else that you do every day, linking to sites uh, and products that you're using. And soon you may well have your own band of merry followers finding you in the search engines because don't forget people like Google love social networks. So you might find yourself appearing in, in, in Google. And also the fact that people on Twitter might find your profile by going doing searches and uh, different uh, information, finding you and following what you're doing, and you could become the next star of Twitter. So that's the social networking traffic video for Twitter.com.